the actual theory consists of four steps, starting from input to impact. And just so you know, you can divide each step even further and subdivide them. But this is a simplification of this theory, obviously, of this framework. So the input is where you start, the impact is where you finish. But actually going into this, we like to first have our problem extremely clear. And then we also like to have our vision, the potential, you know, realized potential, also extremely clear before we start thinking about the actual theory of change. Once we have, and this is what I was just mentioning in the previous slides, right? Once we have those two defined, then we start looking at, well, what are the different inputs we require? And inputs refer to raw resources, capacity, materials, anything that your, the, the basic input, the basic you know, raw resources that go in to uh, what makes your next outputs. And the important thing is it's the most important ones. So what are the most important resources? And I can tell you here, for example, for zebra growth, our team and the internet are probably the two biggest inputs we have, right? And to be more specific, it's the cross-functional team with multi-year experience and blah, blah, blah. I can go further, right? Um, but those are the two most important inputs for us to achieve our change. The next thing is the outputs. What's the direct positive effect your inputs are having? So are people like yourselves in a training course gaining some clarity, gaining some confidence, becoming more conscious and aware on the different frameworks that exist out there that you can you know, apply in the next months within your business? That's probably the direct output that we have with our clients. The next thing is the outcome, which is the midterm ripple effect that your applet has. So here we're starting to look at the, the midterm effects and impacts. And it's maybe not the end impact that we need to get to, Impact is usually more long-term, but it is what's going to lead towards our impact. So then the impact is actually what's the long-term impact that directly feeds into solving your systemic problem, that directly feeds into creating your realized potential.